I beat Dark Souls, so now I'm going to share the tips that helped me get through the game or things that my mentors taught me. How to reach Four Kings Boss. If you don't want to know how to reach the Four Kings Boss, now's the time to back out. So starting at this bonfire and heading down, I'm going to say I saw some other YouTube videos on how to get to the Four Kings and their videos had you dealing with a ghost and this long way around. And so I decided to make a video that is a lot quicker and to like getting there faster and not having to deal with ghost. Um, but yeah, you make your way down. And we go to the elevator and pull the lever. And let's skip waiting for the elevator because we can because it's a video. And also skipping going that. So if you skip jumping down there, you don't have to go all the way down the stairs. And you head on down to the ruins. And this video also assumes that you have already pulled the lever to lower the water. See how the water is much lower now? So I saw videos and they had you going all the way through here, dealing with a ghost. This is going to show you a shortcut um, straight through the ruins, not having to deal with ghosts. Um, there is one thing I do fight, but um, it's not a ghost, so you don't have to be cursed to fight it. Um, so you stick along the, the, the walls. And actually, I learned the shortcut when I was online. Uh, somebody pointed out, like, hey, there's a shortcut down here. Um, so you hug the walls, and you go very carefully. See that ledge down there? You just drop down. There's a tiny bit of damage jumping this way, and then you head this way, into the water. I do fight this guy because he can be really rough on you. He's got a shield right now, and now it's gone. I'm trying to get behind him. I learned targeting, you know, with R3. Yeah, it took me that long to use it in the game. <laughs> I usually slash and whack the easier bad guys. Then you go up these stairs. And then I'm just going to run away from everything. I'm not going to bother fighting anything else. Uh, yeah. Head to the left wall. See the ghosts are chasing me. The creatures are chasing me. I lost a little damage. Uh, but then I run, run, run. And there's their white door. Quick to the white door. And that's a lot faster than all through the ruins and dealing with ghosts. And you want to get away from the white door because they can still attack you. And now I'm safe to take health. You have to have this ring equipped. You will not be able to reach the boss without that. So now you head down. You must equip the ring. If you don't have the ring, it's not going to go well for you. But the, the ring allows you to traverse to the abyss which you need to get to the Four Kings. So just go down the spiral staircase and have your ring equipped. Don't forget that. If you don't have that ring, you might as well not bother coming down here. <clears throat> staircase goes on forever. And then you quite literally fall, and it feels like you're going to die. But when you have your ring equipped, you get to the abyss. And then you can just fight the four kings boss when you see him. There he is!